Hey everyone, today I'm gonna to teach you how to make a detox apple water. It's very good for the metabolism, mainly because of the cinnamon and the ginger that's gonna be in there. And most important, it's really easy to make and I love the flavor. Actually, this is my favorite detox formula, hands down. So what you need to do first, um, I just took two green apples, but you could use the apples of your choice. My mom actually did some of the testing for me and she said the green tasted best to her. But this is basically two cups of water with two tablespoons of white vinegar and two tablespoons of lemon to make sure all the dirt and pesticides are off. Now, I highly recommend organic apples. It's actually one of the most um, dirtiest when it comes to the pesticide chain, but I couldn't find it that day, so I just had this soaking for 20, 20 minutes. And I'm gonna rinse it off real quick. After you rinse off your apples, you're going to get an apple core and slice. Now I got this little picture here, it's really cool, well my mom got it for me rather, um, from Bed Bath & Beyond. By the way, this is a 1.7 liter pitcher. I'm actually going to put the apples on the outside, or the apple slices rather. Here's my second slice, my second apple, sorry. You're gonna get about an inch of ginger and grate it. I wouldn't go crazy with the ginger. You really don't want the ginger to take over the flavor. You d it's just adding some more detox properties um, to this mix, but you really want the apples to be the, the star here, at least I do. If, if you want ginger, add the ginger, but, and I love ginger, but today we're gonna let the apple be the star. Get one stick of organic cinnamon. This came from the Whole, Whole Foods chain. Get one stick, it's about three inches. I'm gonna put it in here. Twist this on. How can I forget? I need to add some water. Duh. This is some filtered water. Oh yeah. And now I'm gonna just stir this just a little bit, but mostly the ginger will go on the bottom on its own, so I'm just gonna put this back on. And that's it. You're gonna let this sit in the refrigerator about six to eight hours or overnight. And I personally eat the apples afterwards. I usually drink this in a day, so the apple still tastes good. And that's about it. Check out my other detox post, and I have a special drink that was made specifically for this detox. And until my next post, Gadget Trish is out. Bye.